when I was awake, I was just like ready to go. I was like just so tired. I didn't get enough. Well, I got sleep, but like I don't think I slept well. We had a plan to meet up at quarter to nine. Where am I going? This Friday, I went to Newcastle University for this sort of HE plus Cambridge trip. And then I think in April, we're going to go down to Cambridge, like for a residential. The night before, I was like, looking at Google Maps to see where we had to go. And like, I was just telling my friends, like, don't worry, if you don't know what you're doing, I know what I'm doing. Like, my chemistry teacher says that, like, he said it, like, three times in the, one of our double lessons. We have a group of, like, 12 people, I think, that uh, went to this trip. Basically, this HE Plus Cambridge thing is about what life is like in uni, looking at some of the courses that you can study at uni, especially at Newcastle. There was three sessions that we were sort of given. My three were personal statements, medicine and study skills and to be fair my day went all right usually allowed to go without my like parents anywhere <laughs> they're pretty protective personal statements like i was alone for that session I, I just sat down and then this last three seats away from me was like hey what's your name <laughs> and i was a bit confused because i'm a pretty shy person i was pretty grateful for that moment because like i was alone that sort of made me a bit more sort of less shy in a way yeah, I went through personal statements and that was actually kind of useful. Yeah, then like, after the session we had a bit of time left. They asked us what my A-levels were <laughs> and then obviously I told them that I had biology, maths, physics and chemistry and they were like a bit, are you crazy? Medicine, we looked at how the heart gets oxygen through the coronary, I don't know how to say, arteries, I think it's arteries. That was actually interesting. And then study skills was my third session and that was literally just about referencing. That lasted all up till like half three. Then I went to bulk buy from Pret for some croissants because that's what we normally do. Like in, as a family, if we ever go to Newcastle, just get croissants for the family. My sister wasn't happy when I didn't get them last time on like a different uni trip. Yeah, I actually got home around like four. I did some maths work when I got home, I was pretty tired. But then around half five, I have a biology tuition and like this one, she stayed longer than an hour because she's like her sort of job, I think is around immunology. That's what we went through on Friday. And like, she always just gets, well, she puts it, she gets excited when we talk about immunology. I was pretty exhausted anyways, because of the trip and during the tuition, we just went through these rubbish questions. Even she agrees that these questions are just sort of waffle. Friday, takeaway day, very tired. My mom was like, just go to bed early or earlier than usual. Early morning routine normally is to just get started on work, but I was like, I've been wanting a haircut for a while. And I was like, just go, down. just go have a haircut now in the morning, so we don't waste time like in the afternoon. I mean, I asked for it to be tidied up, but I don't know how tidied up this is. But Saturday got home. It was all about biology revision because I have to prepare for four tests next week. Don't tell my chemistry teacher. Instead of handling my normal weekly review, I'm just revising for tests. I also went through like two tests, which I'd done in the previous like few weeks. Get my mistakes and then write them down on a piece of paper and then for like the subject test again, I'll just look at that piece of paper and make sure I don't do those mistakes again, hopefully. But my biology revision was going all right up until a certain topic. And I was kind of stuck on cellular and humoral responses. Basically, the immune response split up into two different parts. I think I get it now, but like before, like I was just getting annoyed at it. This is a very crucial point of my day. I was getting a bit triggered. I normally, Saturday, go out at 4-3 o'clock for my volunteering for Magic of Edinburgh. Didn't clip anything because I've talked about it before. Right, I come home, then have like milk, have, just have a snack, get a little biology done. Still a bit annoyed at that topic. I'm also a bit tired. My friend messages me and like, and I asked, do you want to go on Xbox? And that was probably the worst decision I made that day because for me normally, I'm like, I don't stop working until I get everything done. But I was definitely not done with biology. Like, at the time I was like, it's fine, I'll get it done tomorrow. But like, for some reason, I'm on the Xbox and I'm like, I can't get up my head that I've got work to still do. And I'm wasting my time here. It turns out, like, I just couldn't be bothered to play it. It went to shambles. Come off the Xbox at 7 o'clock because I was like, nah, forget this. Or around half seven, I can't remember. And like... I just continue working. I try to get it in my head. I think I got it eventually on Saturday. But two other things were also annoying me. One of the things was I was trying to like record some sort of video to put in the background. 
like just me sort of revising and most of the times I'll get interrupted and I was like Brr! because what I wanted to upload this week well I haven't I'm not gonna upload this week because it's just not gonna work I wanted to upload like revision motivation I've already done half an hour like I've recorded half an hour I've also got a video at half an hour so I was like let's do an hour but me being an idiot didn't realize that it would take forever until it was too late to sort of render and upload <laughs> so i waited till saturday try to record half an hour and got interrupted so that was triggering us because i couldn't get half an hour in at all and then i tried to render it but finished rendering at around 10 o'clock and the timer at the bottom just didn't work like i thought it was because my laptop's trash so when i'm like oh looking through the actual editing software it's just not going to work i like, won't actually yeah, properly. The study motivation, like I didn't put any sound on, but like this timer, 47 milliseconds, I think, in the first 10 minutes. Like that doesn't work, does it? <laughs> I, you see my problem? I know I, I would have done something wrong when I was editing, but yeah, that just didn't work. And you'd think that I'd be like very annoyed. I was already annoyed by the biology. I was already annoyed with the interruptions. I was already annoyed with me not getting an hour into this and I was annoyed at my poor decisions that I made that day anyways. Also not realising that it would take ages to render and upload. I think I'd be very triggered but like for some reason I was just forget it. And that's because of mentality. If something happens that doesn't really go your way just realise that. And there's people out there that are going through things that really aren't going their way and that sort of concept in my head that day was definitely just in my head i was just like don't worry about the video as people are going through things that are worse than what you're going through like i'm worried about video i'm worried about making a day of bad decisions like i told myself you've got tomorrow to make better decisions you've also got next week to upload a video it doesn't really matter if you don't upload this week i guess like just Think it really doesn't matter and if you're sort of sad or a bit annoyed at yourself or triggered just look in the mirror and just pull funny faces <laughs> right enough serious waffly stuff enough of that sunday honestly i was just wasting time in the morning i was like oh youtube click on it to put music on oh no this video interests me this that like click off it then this interests me then around four o'clock i got all my work done literally everything finished biology and I had two chemistry pieces of homework. One of them was to do with equilibrium which I got a test on. So I've got biology test fully revised for. I'd done maths homework on the Friday after university trip. That was maths test on Friday. So I've got biology test on Tuesday, maths test on Friday. Equilibrium, small test, so I'm not really worried about it on Tuesday. And then, so same day as biology, and then I've got a nomenclature test. I'll explain what that is in a minute. On Friday, the same day as my maths test. So I'm, yeah, but I'm not really worried about the chemistry test because I don't think equilibrium will be difficult with GCSE stuff. And the nomenclature test, which is, nomenclature is, oh, I need that. The first time my teacher was like explaining it, explaining it to us was like people can't even say it don't even think about doing nomenclature or understanding a nomenclature that is how you say it, nomenclature yeah <laughs> honestly the first time i got this textbook i was like okay i need to revise for this subject i'd go right to the middle and i realized you starting the course it won't be in the middle <laughs> nomenclature is basically rules well a way of naming organic compounds so like ethene ethane methane Meth no, not methane. Methane. Methane doesn't exist, I don't think. Honestly, it's difficult until you get it. And that brings me on to right now. <laughs> I'm recording on the Sunday, but I'm also trying to vlog about Sunday. What? But yeah, I'm probably just gonna, for the rest of the day, just chill. Tomorrow, biology revision. Thursday, maths revision. And a little bit of chemistry on those days as well. Apart from that, that was me going from highs to lows to highs. I did not get high, I promise. I sort of three days in the life of a four year level, that doesn't... I should have done four days in the life of four year levels, but nah. Three days in the life of four A levels. People do get stressed, even though I'm in this video, I no longer get stressed. That, my mentality is the reason why I don't get stressed, but if you enjoyed this video, leave a like down below. If you want, press the red button. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.